This is the first time that the women's ice hockey team will be in the Olympics for Korea. It's a huge honor to be able to represent Team Korea and to wear that jersey. I started playing hockey when I was five years old. I'd be out there all day. I loved it. After watching the Olympics as a kid, I remember at one point kind of saying to my mom, like, how do I get there? It's crazy to think that um, I'll have my sister in the Olympic Village with me. Marissa is my sister, my best friend. Marissa was coming, and we knew that I was pregnant. And Hannah was born six months, six later. months later. So I live across the street from Hannah and Marissa. I think that I've been to around 300 games. They're kind of like my sisters. I had a decision to make whether I wanted my Korean name or Brant on the back of the jersey, and I chose my Korean name just because it was my one tie to Korea. I would hope that my birth mother would somehow make the connection. Maybe if she sees my story or reads it somewhere that she'll maybe recognize, okay, like this could maybe be my daughter or something like that. It really is so wonderful that both girls are going to be able to go together. I don't think that I will be able to go watch them at the Olympics, even though it went to every single one of Hannah Marissa's hockey games. It's hard. I mean, we're kind of halfway across the world from one another. Hey, Mom. Hi, Mom. <laughs> Hi, Dad. Hey, Kels, miss you. I hope to make you proud in the Olympics. Even when you're not there, I know that I always have something to play for, and that's you guys. I might cry, is that bad? <laughs> oh my gosh. Um... <laughs> Being here um, in my birth country, it's, it's been surreal for me, and um, you know, with the birth mom, uh, it would be special to me, but I really want you to know that you're my mom, and um, no one else. <sighs> no one else could, like, take that role from you. Love you. I can't be there in person. I feel like this will be the second best thing that I can do. 